Good morning, Good morning Mustangs. Mustangs. Today is Thursday, April 26th. I'm your host, Elise. And I'm your host, Anthony. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Attention, salute, pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We will now say the Mustang Pledge. Today, I will do my best to be the best. I will listen, I will follow directions, I will be honest, I will respect the rights of others. I can learn, I will learn, I know it's all up to me. Now for a moment of silence. Please be seated. <clears throat> Lunch today is big turkey over rice or chef salad, sweet potatoes or collards, Apple wedges or strawberry fruit cup and delicious cold milk. And now we have a few announcements. You can purchase World's Finest Chocolate every Friday for a dollar each. Flavors available are crisp, caramel, almond, goofy gummies while supplies last, chocolate covered raisins. Thank you for your support. This morning, we will be having grade level spelling bees for kindergarten, first, and second grade. This afternoon, the Alice Drive Middle School Orchestra will be performing for all fifth graders for all fifth graders during related arts. Fifth graders, please report to the PE room at twelve thirty-five. Tomorrow, grade level spelling bees will take place for third, fourth, and fifth grade. On Saturday, Sumter will hold its annual heart walk to benefit the American Heart Association. Next week is Teacher Appreciation Week. Make a plan to show your favorite teachers how awesome you think they are. And now for a few words from Miss Williams. All right. Teacher Appreciation Week next week, and we do appreciate our teachers, that's for sure. All right, we have um, some birthdays today. We've got Trinity Bells. Well, happy birthday, Trinity, in Miss Horn's class. Jaden Britt in Miss Walter's class. Happy birthday, Jaden. And Damian Kusar in Miss Evans' class. Happy birthday. That is great. We also have um, our Word of Wisdom. <clears throat> This, let's see, Hank Aaron is a retired baseball player who once said, I'll tell you the same thing my mother used to tell me. The most important thing in life is to try to do the very best for your neighbors. Respect other people. Hank Aaron listened to his mom and grew up to be a great baseball player. Why? Because he did his very best for his neighbors on the playing field, his teammates. Here at school, who's your neighbor? Your classmate, right? How can you be a good neighbor to her or him? To be a good neighbor. What could you do? Oh, stuff. No, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, that, how uh, could it be a good neighbor to our classmates? Help them out with their subject. Give them compliments. Oh, I love that. I'd give them compliment. Hey, teacher appreciation. Could you compliment your teacher? Not for the hugs like that. Oh, hugs. I know. Teachers love hugs. Um, I don't know. I would just like something small. Yeah. Like what? Maybe just like offering them a pencil if they don't have one. I think that's a great idea. And you know what? That could sit there and really, really awesome. I mean, help them generate. Perfect. Her fact is so proud. Y'all are doing great. All right. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Well, that's simple. Just be helpful, be kind, and cooperative. Exactly what y'all were talking about. When we respect one another, everyone in the classroom wins because everyone can concentrate on doing his or her best work, just like Hank Aaron. With something to think about, this is Miss Williams. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. And I love how they did this. I have not seen this. So now, I mean, but look at that bucket for third grade. I mean, it's still, um, second grade's catching up too. I know Miss Croft was sitting there giving some out yesterday. Did y'all see that at the bus? I think Miss Metz had to take a couple of them from Miss Croft. She was sort of handing them out uh, freely. <laughs> For good behavior, of course. All right, let's see. I like this. Uh, Y'all have some in here? I'm not sure. Barely. Oh, oh. That's not. All right, we have Kenny. Kenny in Miss Reagan's class for good behavior. All right, Kenny, come on down. Then we also have Janiah Shannon in Miss Watts' third grade for shining in the hallway. I love it when you shine in the hallway. And we have Gavin Kirkman in Ms. Buckner's first grade class. Come on ga down, Gavin, for good behavior. Anaja Calvin in Ms. Williams' class for good behavior. Good job, Ms. Calvin. And we have Morena Durant in Ms. Hudson's class 
um, that Dr. Leach gave for good behavior. And Bradley Thompson in Miss James' class um, for helping others. Good job, Bradley. We just talked about that. And then David DeBose in Miss Lyons' class for following directions. Good job, guys. Y'all come right on down and get your prize. All right. Don't, Don't forget, forget attendance, academics, and behavior. Bye, Mustangs.